Very pleasant. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jeff Eliasoff. Welcome to News 12 at 6. And I'm Caroline Fletcher. An Ada man has been arrested for allegedly trying to meet up with a child for sex. It was all apparently caught on camera. News 12's Dory Vaughn reports. This man is a dangerous man, I will say. Sonic with the Oklahoma Predator Prevention Group says on Sunday, 73-year-old Vernon Wall allegedly attempted to meet with someone he thought was a 15-year-old boy. Instead, he was met by a group of volunteers determined to stop child sexual abuse. If I walked past him in Walmart or something, I wouldn't have looked twice at him to me. I would have think he was a normal man. He is a very dangerous man. Sonic tells me it all started when Wall reached out to an account on an online dating platform that looked like it was owned by a minor. It was all a decoy, but Wall didn't know and began asking for nude pictures and sending explicit photos of himself to the supposed minor. So we'll tell them to text us immediately, and once they text, we'll drop the age to them on text, and it's on them to end the conversation. A lot of times they don't. Even after learning the minor's age, Wall allegedly insisted on meeting the boy at a hotel in Shawnee. That's when he was confronted by Oklahoma Predator Prevention on a live streaming service called Kick. He just told you he was 15. Your response so, so was... He, so, so, he, so, so therefore, he has already admitted he's a liar. Sonic told me he found more than just Wall inside of the hotel room. Six unidentified pills. And a gun with three bullets helping them put evidence together for Shawnee police. It's just dangerous. Like, if this little boy would have showed up, if there was an actual kid here, let's say the boy got scared, didn't want to do this, had to change him up, what was he going to do with that gun at that point, you know? Wall was arrested and taken to the Pottawatomie County Jail and is facing three felony counts of soliciting sexual conduct from minors, as well as possession of a firearm while committing a felony. Every time we get somebody on our hook, my main goal now is to get a conviction. Every one of these guys need to be held accountable and go to jail. Wall's next court date appearance is slated for October 10th. In Ardmore, Jury Vaughn, News 12.